Rachel's been using this manual grinder to grind the coffee, but it's kind of uncomfortable to hold like this for a long period. So she even made these gadgets to help hold it. So now she's threatening to buy a fancy coffee grinder and going, wait, wait, wait. I'm sure I can put a motor on it, specifically this one. And this motor runs at about the right speed, and after I flip the armature around, it even runs in the right direction. The challenge is how to couple it onto here. My first thought was to just have an arm sticking off of this one to crank this around, but having this thing flailing around like that might be more dangerous than it needs to be. Then the next thought was to make something that goes on here that has an oblong hole like that, and really the ideal shape for that would be something like this, which is already part of this. Now this needs to engage with this thing here to fix the uh, fine adjustment, but I could still engage the top of this thing just by engaging the shoulders of these arms. And here's the part, except I forgot to take into account this knob here, so it doesn't actually fit, so I made the whole part again a little bit taller with room for the knob. Ah, tight fit on there. For now, I'm just attaching it on there with a piece of copper wire, so if things go wrong, that'll just shear off. Now this goes on here, the grinder goes in here, I cut down those brackets a bit, they're going to go here, and then somehow the motor gets mounted on top of it all. I think these two little brackets will mount that motor at just about the right height. Okay, I got it wired up with the capacitor and just some cut blades because I'm not sure this will work. So let's plug it in. Oh, excellent. Well, that's very finely ground. It turns out that coffee was ground too fine, and I also need to move everything up a bit so that this slides in under there. And I cut this bracket up to make this part here, which will hold up the motor a little bit better than these little angle brackets. I put a power cord on there, and the power switch, and the wiring is buried in the back here. I didn't film that, because that's just bait for the safety trolls. Well, there it is put together now. If we end up using it, it'll certainly be a conversation piece. Coffee. Because Jimmy coffee.